suppose that your spouse, ex-spouse dies and you discover that he or she never changed their will or their life insurance policy to take your name off the policy and the will. So you're divorced, but your name is on the will as a beneficiary. Do you still get to collect? Hi, my name is Laura Hurd and I'm an attorney practicing family law, probate and wills here in San Antonio. A lady came to me recently with that issue. Her husband, um, had ex-husband had recently died and she was named as a sole beneficiary of the will. The answer is, it depends on when the will was signed. If the will and the life insurance policy were set up before the divorce happened, then they're no good and she is not able to collect. Those provisions leaving her money or property are by law declared to be invalid because of the divorce. But if after the divorce, he made a new will and he still named her as beneficiary, or after the divorce, he contacted the life insurance company and still named her as beneficiary, then she would be able to collect. So he has to reaffirm or show his intention to make her a beneficiary after the divorce for her to be able to collect. Otherwise, the law says it is presumed that the minute you got divorced, that those provisions were meant to be void. Now, if you are in the middle of a divorce and your spouse dies before you go to court and finalize the divorce, then you're still married. In Texas, you're either married or you're divorced. If you haven't been declared divorced, even though a divorce proceeding was pending, you're still married and you're still able to collect on the will and um, the life insurance policy. So it's all in the timing. But the best thing to do, the best policy is once you get divorced, make a new will, make a new beneficiary um, designation on your life insurance policy. Clear up those things so that there is no question what you intended. I'm Laura Hurd. I hope this is helpful.